Hey everyone, I am Almar from AlmarsGuides.com and this video here is going to show you the easiest way to farm the black mushroom for the staff of herding. Now to get started what you want to do is select the reign of the black king quest from uh, your character screen thingy. From here you want to enter the game and right from the waypoint in town you are going to want to take the, hold on let me grab my Templar from this waypoint in town you're going to port to the cathedral garden check to see if this little chest is here which it is not go into Leork's passage this is where you uh, save Deckard Kane if you need a uh, idea of where we are and then you want to go into cathedral level one which is where the black mushroom can be found now the black mushroom is a completely random spawn on or uh, actually I went the wrong way <laughs> Uh, my apologies. You want to go up here rather than down there. Keep that in mind. And uh, if you do accidentally go down there, remember when you see Cathedral Level 2, that's not where you're supposed to be. It's supposed to be on Cathedral Level 1. Uh, <clears throat> the lag's not really that good on these mobs. Now, as I was saying, the Black Mushroom can spawn anywhere on this level. It usually spawns right off of like a hallway or one of the main rooms. It's like a little darkened. Uh, area from where I remember getting it previously. The Black Mushroom and Leoric Shinbone are the only two items that I have for uh, the Staff of Herding currently. So uh, once I do find it, I'm actually not going to pick it up, but indeed I am going to show it to you and all that fun stuff. Now due to the fact that unlike Leoric Shinbone, I'm probably going to die here. Unlike Leoric Shinbone, uh, it isn't a fast, you can just reset it and then, you know, redo it, redo it, redo it, redo it. You actually have to clear this whole level and search for it. Uh, hold on one second, please. I'm getting my ass handed to me. Pop Spirit Walk, grab the health globes, back to full health. Now, uh, as I was saying, I might not be able to find it in the duration of this video, considering I have to clear the whole entire floor and I am doing it on Inferno difficulty, which if you're actually here just after the shin bone, then... Uh, I would recommend doing this on normal, but I'm kind of accomplishing two different types of videos at once here because uh, I have another video in mind that is going to completely detail loot that I'm getting on Inferno. So uh, it's, it's useful for me to be running it on Inferno right now. That and I'd also like to make some extra money while doing it anyway because I need to buy a better weapon for my Witch Doctor. So what we're going to be doing here is literally just exploring absolutely everything. Now, the Black Mushroom doesn't spawn in a random place uh, in Cathedral Level 1. I mean, essentially, it does, but the room that it spawns in will always be the same. Like, if you notice when playing Diablo, uh, each of the levels are randomly generated, yes. But they use the same uh, texture and architecture for hallways, rooms, and certain things such as that. So, while everything is random, uh, with layout and... Things such as that, the architecture, and the way certain rooms look will always be the same. So, in other words, the Black Mushroom's room is always the same. You just need to hope that it's there. Now, uh, <clears throat> the Black Mushroom is pretty easy to find. Uh, unlike the, the uh, next few videos I'll be making, which will cover the, uh, I'm trying to think, Wurtz Bell, which can actually just be bought in uh, Act 2, Gibbering Gemstone, I think it is which is uh, found in Act 3 in the Caverns of Frost, which is one of the more difficult ones to find because not only do you have to get the Caverns of Frost to spawn, but you also have to get a name to spawn inside there. So it's like double random number generation, which is uh, sometimes annoying. And then there's also a Liquid Rainbow, which is uh, found in the Daglur Oasis during Act 2. So I got a few more items to get after this, and then I'll be able to make the Staff of Herding, and then I'll probably make like a pony video just to show you what it's all like in there and all that fun jazz. So, <clears throat> ultimately, as you see here, uh, I'm just slowly working my way through the cathedral. This would be a lot more fast-paced if I was on a lower difficulty again, but I wanted to make money at the same time and accomplish two things. So, uh, if you do decide to farm this on Inferno, I guess you're going to be getting probably maybe 10 to 15k gold per run, plus whatever loot you find. Um, it shouldn't take too long to clear all of this, to clear all of Cathedral Level 1, maybe 10 to 15 minutes, depending on what your gear is like. Um, 
if your gear is uh, pretty crappy, like my monk has pretty crappy gear right now, it might take a little bit longer, or there might be just some name packs that you just straight up can't kill anyway. Um, in that case, you can do hell if you still want to make a decent amount of money, or normal if you just want to find the black mushroom and get the frig out of there. So, <clears throat> that choice is entirely up to you. And uh, since we're on the topic of stuff, that's the topic I'm on at least. Uh, if you need, a, if you want to see a written version of this guide and a written version of all the other items required in the Staff of Herding, then uh, follow the link in the description of this video, which will take you to my website. Also, I'd like to say, uh, or I'd like to add, if you are interested, if you like the video and you're interested in helping me uh, in any in any way possible, where you know, like repaying the favor for me helping you, essentially. Um, you can like the video, which helps a lot. Post a comment, just anything positive. I mean, if you, even if you want to post something negative, I guess I really don't care. At least it'll give me something to laugh about when the comment gets voted down so much that it gets removed. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, like a video, like my website on Facebook. That actually helps out substantially. Posting a comment helps. Subscribing to me helps even more because another loyal viewer always makes me happy. Um... And there's plenty of things you can do. Once again, just visit my website. I also have a donation thing set up, but I'll never force anybody to donate anything to me as uh, much as it actually does help. And, you know, re I guess you could say refill morale for doing this work in the first place. As this isn't exactly the highest paying job, but I guess I can't really complain because it is indeed an enjoyable one. So... <clears throat> Those are a few things you can do to uh, you can do to assist me. Now, uh, the I guess since I really don't have anything else to talk about while farming here, as uh, as I've said in previous videos, I'm not very good at thinking of things to talk about on the spot. I'm, I'm quite the uh, I'm quite the introverted type, and I I do go through extroverted phases, but that's quite infrequent. And uh, you know, I'm probably the I. I'll brag about it because I really don't mind. There's actually the black mushroom, so that kind of sums it up. Uh, what I wanted to say was I'm probably the biggest nerd you'll hear commentary from on YouTube. And uh, all the more reason to listen to me. I play, this, I play video games probably like 16 hours a day. I have nothing else to do, so. But uh, here's the black mushrooms. As you can see, Cathedral Level 1. Didn't take me too long to find it. This video has been going on for, hold on, 7 minutes and 53 seconds. So it actually took less time to uh, get it than Leoric Shinbo. Uh, but this is what the black mushroom room looks like. As you can see, it's off of two hallways right here. So once you find it, cheers. That's pretty much all there is to it. Uh, once again, if you want a text version of this guide, look in the description for the link. Uh, I'm, I hope you enjoy the video and I really do hope that it assisted you in finding the black mushroom. Happy hunting and good luck, and if you get into Ponyland, enjoy it.